What's your favorite Bill Walton story? Um, Bill. Um, so, you know, Bill's a big Grateful Dead fan. Mm -hmm. And um, so uh, they, um, you know, we'd fly into San Francisco and he goes, oh, Berkeley, the capital of the world, you know. So <laughs> anyway, he's he, he's like, so the dead go, we used to go, I don't I guess they don't nowadays, but they used to go on these tours or concert tours and they and they go to, and all the deadheads follow them. They, you know, they mm -hmm. caravan and camp out. And so they're in, uh, they come to the Boston area for about a week because they play uh, Providence, Rhode Island and Worcester, Mass, about an hour from Boston. They play like three shows or three or four shows at each place. And so they're there about a week. So at practice during that week, during those years, uh, some of the guys from the band, and this is like 10, 11 a.m. in the morning, would come to the practice, you know, and these guys, uh, I don't remember all the names, but uh, Phil Lesh, I think, Phil Weir, Weir, Hart, Kretzman, I can remember some last names, come to the practice and we go, we go, Bill, when, when's Jerry Garcia gonna come to <laughs> come to practice? And, and, and Bill says, he says, Jerry hasn't seen daylight since 1968, <laughs> <laughs> which is probably true. <laughs> Oh, uh, I, I mean, so then, yeah, then, then they, I didn't go and Danny didn't go, but there's a great story about, uh, the, the, some of the guys, most of the guys on the team went with Bill to the dead concert out in Worcester and they got him up on the stage and gave him tambourines and maracas <laughs> and stuff like that. 